What's up guys, Sneaky Reviews 420, back at it again with another video, hope everybody's having themselves a very snazzy day, and yeah, we're gonna jump right into it, so today we got the Smart Cart Review, oh wait, before this video, if you guys are under 18, please make sure to click off the video, alright yeah, I remember to say it this time, okay, but this is the smart cart review um i picked this up from a friend i don't think you can find these in dispensaries and if you can it it's not the best dispensary but um i have had them before they're not terrible um yeah pretty good um right here we have the purple rain indica i believe it was 82.73 percent i don't know that probably doesn't mean anything just the packaging but yep so right here we got the cart in this little fold out box it's kind of cool it has like a nice close up of what this string would look like oh wait whoa that's really bad focus very obviously blood though really un unfocused picture and then it's got the butt on the back. But yeah. So right off the bat, these carts are really large. If you guys have a battery like the low key battery, I do know that the smart carts do not fit in here. So if you were to put it in here, it, it doesn't fit. It's not going to go in. So low key bats won't work. I mean they will but you can't close that shit just a heads up in case you guys are a low-key user so yeah let's take a dry hit very very potenty almost I, I, I want to say I can taste the cannabinoids but I don't know that's just a dry hit but really herby really really herby yeah let's get right into it I'm excited this is the brass knuckles battery I recommend you guys check out brass knuckles a really reliable brand I, I haven't had to heck buy a new battery in a long time I mainly use this favorite bat but yeah Preheat. Ah, preheat never hits. But while this is working, um, I might as well tell you more about this brand. Um, I've seen it for a while now. It's been a good couple months since I've seen it. Um, it's a Los Angeles brand, and yeah, they so they're supposedly organic. Um, top quality. And for medical use only, totally. But yeah. <sighs> right away, it's strong throat hit. Very strong. Like a punch in the throat very herby almost no like extra flavor i can definitely taste the cannabinoids quite sensational on the taste buds quite sensational i'd rate this like a solid 8 out of 10 My 10 out of 10 would definitely be the, the Raw Garden cars. If you guys haven't seen Raw Garden brand, top quality band. They, they, they make the best quality concentrates, best quality, best quality flour, 
best quality wax I recommend you guys check them out but it's very expensive very expensive yeah but if you guys have the money for it like $30 a half gram 50 to $60 full gram and like $35 eighths if you guys have that kind of money I recommend you guys get it really 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 good raw garden yeah you guys gotta try that but this is a good 8 out of 10 I would recommend you guys pick this up if you see it and you're a little short on cash you're trying to cop a, a, a cheaper full gram no complaints I can't say I have any complaints here the concentrate does move a little quickly but it's very clear and it doesn't taste off And it's not extremely fast. So, if you guys are worried about the pesticides, where I am, there, I really don't find much wax with pesticides in the heart of LA, Santa Monica. But, yeah. If you guys are worried about that, you should definitely be copping from only dispensaries. But, yeah. This was the Smart Cart Organic Purple Rain Review. I hope everybody's been having a snazzy day. Make sure to leave a like and a comment on the video if you guys enjoyed. Um, my channel was kind of blowing up when I first started posting videos. I was getting way more views than I thought I would right off the bat. So make sure you guys keep supporting the channel. I really appreciate it. I'll keep the daily uploads coming. Sorry again about this weekend, this prior. Um, I, I don't know. I, I had a corrupted video and then I just really got lazy the next day. I just really discouraging, but... I'm back. I uploaded yesterday. I'm back on the daily upload grind. I keep expecting another video tomorrow. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see. I'm going to be bringing a story time Sunday, I think, on Sunday. And, yeah, I hope everybody had a snazzy day. This was Sneaky Beaver for, or Sneaky Reviews 420. Signing out. Peace, guys.